The Kenya National Highway Authority is mulling the introduction of toll fees on major roads, including the Thika Superhighway, if a policy it is crafting is realized. The toll road policy, which Kenna says is currently at discussion level, will guide which roads will be affected by the proposed policy that will be subjected to public participation. Here's Seth Alale with the details. With the dust yet to settle on the controversial implementation of the road maintenance levy effected last month, Kenyans may in the near future be slapped with an additional charge for their use of roads. The Kenya National Highway Authority is in the process of formulating road tolling policy that if approved will see Kenyans begin to pay toll fees on major roads. According to Kenha, roads that will be presented for consideration include Thika Superhighway, Nairobi Southern Bypass, Nairobi Nakuru Mau Summit Highway, Kenol Sagana Marua Road, Mombasa Southern Bypass, and the newly opened Dongo Kundu Bypass. In confirming the possible introduction of the new toll fees, if the policy is approved, Kenha through its official X account, states that it appreciates the ongoing discussion around the development of a road tolling policy. The policy will be developed with extensive public participation to ensure that all voices are heard. Kenha defending the formulation of the new policy by stating that the fee collected will be used for construction of new roads, expanding network and improving connectivity across the country. And that the toll fees will contribute to the repayment of loans used to fund major road projects, thereby supporting long-term financial sustainability, such as the loan used for the construction of the Dongo Kundu bypass. Motorists are currently paying toll fees for the Nairobi Expressway managed by the Moja Expressway Company. Road users pay between 160 and 500 shillings to use the 27-kilometer road that connects Jomo Kenata International Airport to various parts of the city, all the way to Westlands. Seth Olale, Citizen TV.